Can you tell me a little bit about your mission and why you got into this work? In 2013, I was diagnosed with genital herpes. What I, at that point in time, needed for myself was just to know that I was still a person, that it wasn't something that was going to always define me. One of the things that I saw was just how interconnected a person's sexual health status change was with their mental health status change. So the birth of Something Positive for Positive People as a 501c3 nonprofit organization serving people who were struggling with herpes stigma took place. Yeah, and I think, um, you know, what started off as primarily folks living with HSV, sharing their stories of disclosure diagnosis and how they were coping has now become sort of a multidisciplinary sort of resource hub, which is fantastic.